Hi, I'm Andrew with NVIDIA and you're watching GeForce Garage. NVIDIA GPUs aren't just for PC gaming. You can use them for all sorts of things, but today our friend Eric from NZXT is here to show us exactly how we're going to build an awesome PC for our friend Rick, who's an animator, a gamer, and an actor. And he's going to use this PC to do some amazing things. So Rick, tell us a little bit about the Octane Renderer. I'm a huge fan of Octane because it actually uses the GPU and the CUDA cores of the NVIDIA cards to render out its processes in a much faster rate than a CPU. Okay, so that's good news. What we're gonna do is we're gonna use three Titan X's in your build, which equals over 9,000 CUDA cores, so that should be enough to at least cut some time off your rendering, right? Absolutely. So that's a great start, but of course, GPU's gotta go somewhere. So that's where Eric comes in. Where are we going to put these things? The case we selected was a Noctis N450 case that we customized specifically for this build. Sweet. Well, uh, let's go take a look at the Noctis and how we're going to chop it up and tear it down and build it back up. What we're going to be using today is an NZXT Noctis 450 case. We did some custom modifications to the case. We took a H440 side panel and mounted it to our Noctis 450 case since they share the same chassis so we get a little better overview of the components going inside the case. What we're going to be using to control the whole system is an Asus X99 Deluxe motherboard, a Intel 5960X processor. The workhorse of the rig is going to be our three NVIDIA Titan Xs. We have 64 gigabytes of DDR4 Kingston HyperX memory. We have two one terabyte OCZ storage drives. Powering the system is gonna be NZXT Hell 90 V2 1200 watt power supply. What we're gonna to use to be cooling the system are XSPC and EK. Growing up, I used to draw a lot. I used to be big into to painting and, and actually graffiti. And then my dad used to sell IBM computers, so I naturally fell in love with computers. I built my first computer when I was 13. It was a 386DX, and there was MS Paint, which I used to fool around with. Somehow I just incorporated my, my drawings into doing it on the computer. I was always into animation and cartoons, and I was like, this is what I want to do. This is what I want to be when I grow up. Right now I have a 4770K with a single 980. It works great for me right now, but um, with the extra manpower, the triple Titan X's is gonna be a heck of a lot more efficient. A lot faster uh, render times, which basically I'll be able to create a lot more things in less amount of time. We did do a few custom things for this, a black and green NVIDIA Claw NZXT logo, PSU shroud. Also what we did is color match green USBs and green panels. So it ties everything in together along with the cables, the coolant and all the water cooling that we're doing. So it all matches. The last thing that we did custom was a green rear aisle LEDs. So when you're in the middle of the night, flip that button on and you can see everything, so you're able to plug stuff in the middle of the night without having to turn any more lights on. So Now what we're gonna do is get the Titan cards in, get all the piping started, and get it booted. Let's do this.
Wow, look at that baby. This is an incredible build. So, Rick, what are you gonna do with this amazing machine? First of all, I'm gonna make some badass renders and then also working on my own animated series. So, really? if you would like, follow me on Twitter, twitter.com slash Rick Malambri, and uh, I'll keep you updated. And as well as NZXT, don't forget to check them out. Amazing builds and amazing hardware. I couldn't wait to give the beast a test run, so I decided to model up a scene. So I fired up Cinema 4D, then I set up all my Octane render settings, and started modeling out a scene. And now for the moment of truth. On my old rig, this would probably take overnight. Like, I would leave the scene rendering and go to sleep and then wake up the next morning and hope that everything turned out right. But now, it just took 21 minutes. This is going to make my work so much more efficient. I'm able to see my work in real time and be able to make adjustments on the fly. And this is only possible by the NVIDIA GPUs we put in the computer. So thank you, GeForce Garage. This couldn't be done without you. Don't forget to check out geforce.com slash garage for more awesome guides and videos. And of course, if you have any suggestions of things you'd like us to do, please leave them in the comment section below. You're watching GeForce Garage, the ultimate resource center for designing, building, and customizing your GeForce PC. If you're looking for more awesome videos from GeForce Garage, go ahead and check out these two videos right here. I can tell you, you're going to learn a lot, you're going to enjoy yourself, and you may even come out on top. Right here is one, and right here is the other. Go ahead, click them. Try and click them at the same time, and maybe both will open in different windows. That's not going to happen, but you can try. <laughs>